Sometimes the holidays are a bitch. Mm hmm. I'm Ismail. And I'm Rachel. And this is Help, Help Us. Today we want to talk about the holidays, our own traditions, and what we do during the holidays. And we also want to talk about going through the holiday season with gut issues. Because obviously that's not fun for the people going through it or the people that have to deal with it. Or when we destroy people's bathrooms at their houses. Rachel, tell me how it is for you to go to holiday parties. Uh, I find I really struggle. I find I never know what's going to make me sick. Whenever I go to holiday parties or even any party, I always bring like an appy or something I know I can eat. If all else fails, I will eat that one thing all night. I would try and make it holiday themed. I would try and make like a fan favorite and then make it into something gluten free and vegan. Yeah, what about you? What are your struggles? Basically, my weakness is baked goods. Cookies are everything to me. It's hard to resist the temptation of having like shortbread during the holidays or eggnog. I love eggnog. Avoiding those things is hard, especially when you go to parties and everybody... I made this beautiful spread. And full. You can have rum. Fireball. Yeah, if you want your insides to be on fire. No. So you're in for a treat today. We are making a dairy-free vegan eggnog. Yes. And cookies. And cookies. They're pumpkin oatmeal oh. with a vegan buttercream. Yeah, they are. First, before we move on to that, we want to talk about traditions. Tradition! What goes on in your household? We typically go to Edmonton. No booing. No <laughs> booing. We typically go to Edmonton on my auntie's acreage, and we sleep there Christmas Eve. And then we have breakfast and presents. Um, then we go on a sleigh ride, mm -hmm. and we pull this like giant black mat behind the sleigh <coughs> that's pulled by the trailer. Mm -hmm. Everybody just like jumps on it, and the goal is to like push people off. Why? Some good old Christmas aggressive fun. Does somebody win a prize that's left of you? No. Not breaking something. Has no. anyone ever broken anything? Ah, uh, no. The game's safe, guys, if you want to try it at home. And then also, I started a new tradition. I always go to a movie on Christmas Day. Okay, what are you doing for the holidays? All right, so Christmas Day happens to be my sister's birthday. So we go to my parents' house around noon. Then we get there and we do our little gift exchange and spend the day with my parents. And then usually in the evening, my entire extended family comes over for my sister's birthday. Awesome. Well, next we are going to show you how to make our eggnog and our cookies. These are recipes that are definitely going to sit well with your stomach. These are great things to bring to parties. As far as the eggnog goes, there's coconut milk. Coconut milk, almond milk, mm -hmm. uh, cinnamon, nutmeg, and maple syrup. Yes, maple syrup, which you can substitute with dates as well. Mm -hmm. um, and then as far as the cookies go, We've got oat flour, oats, pumpkin puree, vegan butter, nutmeg, cinnamon, love, love, and a splash of vanilla. And the vanilla we used today has some bourbon in it. Yeah, or bourbon, bourbon flavor. Yeah. Whatever. And it's delicious. It's really good. Here is our finished eggnog. So good. It is so good. Oh, and it tastes kind of bourbony. It does taste a little bourbony. Mmm, nice touch. We didn't even put any rum in it this time. We didn't. Last time we did. <laughs> we did something a little bit different with the buttercream this time. Oh, yeah! So the recipe that I got, um, it was like a, a lot of sugar. So we subbed for the cookies, um, we subbed coconut sugar. The original recipe I think calls for a cup of brown sugar mm -hmm. and half a cup of regular sugar. Mm -hmm. We put just half a cup of coconut sugar, which I like things that are not really sweet. Yeah, those tasted a lot better. And then the buttercream was supposed to have two cups of powdered sugar. I said no. So she instead, said no. No. 
So instead, it has just a little can of the coconut cream. Um, put it in the fridge and just scrape off the top layer, throw that in, uh, half a cup of the vegan butter, and then about half a cup of coconut sugar, cinnamon, and nutmeg. And that's it. And it's delicious. Delicious. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. And go make some for yourself. Do it. Go right now. And if you like this video, make sure you give us a thumbs up and subscribe. Subscribe. She's so nice during the holidays. <laughs> I love the holidays. Is that it? Yeah. Great. That's so good. So buttery. Yeah.